All right, here's here's the crib. I'll give you a little uh, little tour. It's a mess, okay? But that's the whole point. We're going to clean it up. My life's a mess, and one thing that's indicative of your life being a mess is your living space is a mess. So if you start cleaning it up, you can feel so much better about your mind if your fucking life is cleaned up. Here's my, like... Here's my shit. My like, kitchen back there. Here's like where I, I, got, I do some work here sometimes. I can look out the window. It's kind of cool. Got my giant. I got to do something with this fucking whiteboard. Okay. I work a lot, so I do a lot of whiteboard shit. But it's just chilling here. Like, bro, put that somewhere. What are we doing here? There's a little pod studio. I actually, turn this light on. It's a little pod studio. I got to put something on the wall there. I haven't done that yet. But you can't see it in the pod, so it's kind of whatever. This little thing here. That's not normally there. I got to move that too. I moved that because I had someone staying here. But anyway, here's the kitchen. <laughs> disaster. Fucking disaster. But we're going to clean it all up. Look, pizza. I feel bad about myself. Not because I eat pizza, because I eat shitty pizza. So anyway, we're going to clean all this shit up. Just a little spot. But, you know, it's my little spot. Okay? So anyway, we're going to first start with this little fucking table here. But on a serious note, tuna sub, actually kind of fire. Listen, if, you're, if your living space is a mess, your life is probably a mess, so you got to clean that stuff up first. So whatever you're doing right now, just listen. Just listen. Put this, listen to this video and find something in your life to clean up. All right? This trash, trash, water bottle, trash. Actually, I actually need some water because I've been spitting a lot. Oh, it feels good. So you got to rehydrate. You got to rehydrate. That's what we're going to do first. Trash. Not trash, but listen. Hang on. I'm going to show you guys something. Ultra, th ultra thin salty sticks. Gas pack from Walmart. Listen, we're going to throw all this stuff away. And... Yeah, we're just going to do a little, like, I don't know what we're going to do. But we got to do something with this whiteboard because it's a pain in the ass. So you can see I got a million fucking supplements. Obviously, sponsored by Legion. But it's not me trying to sell you Legion supplements. I'm just saying they are good. They are good. I'll go over, I'll go over the ones that I use all the time and the ones that I, I kind of forget to use all the time. But anyway, trash. We're going to take out this fucking trash here. Oh, it's already full. Already full. Anyway... I don't think you guys want to see me clean up my house, so I showed you a little bit, and I'm going to set up my little meditation chair, and we'll go over some habits in a minute, but I'm going to clean it all up, and then we'll be back. So, yeah, it's kind of boring, but normally, I'm going to, I'm going to bump some music, and we're just going to get this done, and we're going, to, we're, going to, we're going to see how quickly we can do this, and but still do it well. We'll be back. All right. Made some progress here, baby. Look at this. Ah, so much more open. But listen, I got my little meditation chair set up. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing here. Got my little meditation chair set up. Boom. All right. So this is what we're going to do here. Yeah, just put it right there. Just put it right there. So listen, we're trying to start a new habit. It's my meditation chair. I used to meditate like every day. Uh, now I don't. Now I don't. It's part of the reason why I'm like, just doing that. But I do go to a sound bath meditation class every Tuesday, most of the time. But anyway, if you want to start a new habit, it needs to be convenient. It needs to be convenient or you're not going to do it. That's just how it works. That's why I put my little meditation chair right there. So at nighttime, in the morning, I like it in the morning, but nighttime is good too. Five minutes, 10 minutes. I have a little 10 minute, I go on YouTube, 10 minute meditation music, boom. And then there's like a million of them. Five minute, you can do six minute, there's a million of them. That's good. So here's what we got. We got the pause studio. Got my books. I got to keep the books out. And my sandwich, let me eat that. But books, listen, I read all kinds of books. Books have basically been my mentor my whole entire life. We're going to go over a couple of my books real quick. You want to be a fucking ninja? I've read about ninjas. Why? I don't know. It's just kind of cool. Biomechanics. Biomechanics of musculoskeletal injuries. This book here, got this from Louis Simmons. R.I.P. So I went up there, I worked with him for my, on my master's degree for biomechanics, for my thesis. And I felt pretty good because he has a lot of books. And he's like, here, 
I got a book for you. And I was like, I already read that one. I already got it. He's like, okay, cool. Gives me another one. Here. I was like, I already got that one too. We go through four books and then he gives me this one. I'm like, I just made me feel good. Made me feel good. Like, yeah, dude, I fucking use my brain. But anyway, we got the kitchen cleaned up, dishes done. It just feels so much better when your space is clean, right? It just feels so much better. But now what we're going to do, we're just going to vibe and we're going to cook some eggs here. We're going to cook some eggs, some egg whites. Hang on. Wait a tick. Boom. Egg whites and watermelon. That's what we're going to do. We're not going to cook the watermelon. We're just going to eat it. We're just going to eat it. But here's how it goes. So I cook egg whites in a big batch because this is part of my pre-workout meal, my pre-workout shake. So I do like a little, little bit higher than medium. A little sh on here, a little, a little on there. You know what I mean? Put one of these junksters on there. Egg whites. I cook a whole ass carton. And then we're just gonna we're just gonna let them cook. I don't put anything on there because we're gonna blend it up. I'm gonna give you the secret here. You ready for the secret? This is a broke ass pan, but don't judge me. Don't judge me. First of all, watermelon. Let's get a taste. That's good. That's good. All right, so we're gonna do my little shake here. Why isn't this going higher? Anyway, this is my pre-workout meal. Boom. Banana. 100 grams. I do 100 grams, but you don't need 100 grams because you're not as big as me. Or if you're bigger, then you need more. 100 grams of banana. That's what we're going to start with. Boom. Boom. I think this is about 100 G's here. Anyway, it's got fat, protein, carbs. Boom! You listen, listen. Damn it. It was at 100. It's at 100, I swear. But now it's at 99. I need you guys to see that. I'm pretty fucking good. That was first, first go, baby. First go. All right. Next, we're going to do Greek yogurt. Non-fat, Greek yogurt. This is what we're gonna do here. I'm gonna put this up on this little stool here. I gotta get my other, my other tripod. Okay, we're gonna do 235 G's of this here. And I've been doing this for as long as I can remember. I do this exactly two hours before I work out. Take a little bit out. 235, damn it, I didn't need that. All right, out. Next. Frozen strawberries. Frozen blueberries. Actually, next is, the, is 100 grams of egg whites, cooked egg whites, but they're cooking, right? So we're going to put those in later. This is for tomorrow morning because I need, I need to make my life as easy as possible because I know that I struggle to make decisions in the morning if I'm not super motivated and I need to go to the gym and I need to come back. I need to be back by 11 because I have a phone call at 11. And... I know if I can save myself like 30 minutes in the morning, getting everything ready, I'm much more likely to do it. So that's what I'm gonna do. 130, what am I doing? Yeah, 140, 140 grams. Losing my mind here. 140 grams, frozen strawberries. And then we're gonna take it up to 210, the frozen blues, Walmart brand, baby. It goes over a little bit, that's okay. 214. NBD. A little coconut oil. We're gonna do 10 grams of that. So 
some something to be exact. Then I'm gonna put a hundred grams of cooked egg whites in here. And then I just put this joint on here, throw it in the fridge. I wait to blend it up in the morning because I don't know, it just gets weird if you leave it in there, blend it up. But anyway, got my space cleaned up. And this is gonna be my commitment for tomorrow. First of all, listen, I'm not trying to brag. I'm not trying to brag. On a serious note, I'm just excited about it. I got invited to a private party. Well, clean up the house. And I think it's gonna be pretty cool. I'm gonna try to take the cam there. That's short for camera, in case you guys didn't know. And I think there's gonna be some people there that you might know. But anyway, we'll see. That's on a different day. I can't give too many details because it's a surprise. But it's gonna be dope. Anyway. So cooking these egg whites. Anyway, this, this is my commitment. So this is what I used to do on the regular. Wake up, water, journal, meditate, breakfast, gym, right? That's a lot to get, that's a lot to jump into. So I'm, I'm not gonna just jump into all of that because I know I'm not gonna be able to sustain that. So I'm just gonna wake up, eat. That's my goal, wake up, eat, gym. Cause I haven't been, do I haven't even been doing that. So that's what we're gonna do tomorrow. And then I'm gonna have a bonus. Meditation's gonna be a bonus. Cause I know that when my mind is right, the rest of my life comes together. So I go, oh, I don't have time to meditate. Listen, there's a little like Buddhist saying, you should meditate for 20 minutes every day. You don't have the time, meditate for an hour. Meaning you got the time, right? 